Yo, what's going on guys? It's your boy Max here. Welcome back to another Fortnite video. Today, I'm going to be showing you lot how to do the triple edit properly and how to triple edit with ease on any platform. Now, of course, it will be hard on things like console, Nintendo Switch and mobile. And uh, as well as that, controller, I would say, is the harder you know input to do it on but everything can be done i mean phase suede does that sort of stuff on controller with ease so i mean it's pretty hard to compare a normal person to phase suede because he's just a freak at the game but you guys get the point you can get this down if you try hard enough anyways though let's get right into it so what you want to start off by doing is crouch when you do this the reason being is you can roughly figure out where you need to be going into the first and then second edit and then finally third. But anyways, try at least walking when you do this sort of stuff. Um, I can't exactly do that because I do have sprint by default on, but that's definitely where you want to start off. Anyways, the next tip for your triple edits is going to be small crosshair movements. I see so many people just shaking it about like this when there's literally no need to. Look at how close I keep together on my crosshair, as in I don't just, you know, randomly just shove it in any direction possible as you can see this is all it takes it takes like a couple millimeters or maybe like just under a centimeter of mouse movement when you do go into the first um, sort of double edit so maybe doing this will actually help you and make sure you do get the timing right of uh, when you do press the key I was too far from the ramp there let's try that again so you want to start off slow And then you kind of want to speed it up as you go. As you can see, sometimes it doesn't let you because you do it too fast. So that's why you really want to get the timers down. Anyways, after you've done that, you want to full sprint it. The third edit is much harder than the other two. The first two are a breeze, but as soon as you put that wall down, it gets a little bit harder, I'm not going to lie. And I do mess up quite a bit when I do this, unless, uh, well, until I do practice in creative. Now, once again, the key here would be to be reserved with uh, how much you move your mouse and your crosshair. Now, I'm not gonna lie, I still kind of suck at this. Uh, I do get it off sometimes and you only see in the parts where I do get it off. Most of the time I don't, unfortunately, but that's what creative is here for. And by the way, I wouldn't say the triple edit is super necessary. I feel like this edit is the more important one, the double edit. And I did make a video about it very recently. I will be linking a uh, video in the top right hand corner right now, so you can go check that out. But anyway, I hope this video did help. I wouldn't say this is one of my best guides, but uh, I feel like I gave you some uh, solid tips when it comes to your crosshair movement, which is probably the most important thing in the triple edits. And uh, your edit timing as you can see that one was really good and that one wasn't but anyways that brings the guide to the end i hope it was helpful and if it was make sure to drop a like and subscribe for the best fortnite tutorials around here and make sure you do hit that notification bell to never miss another upload from your boy ever again and finally before you guys do go make sure you guys are using the code maxgamer7 in the fortnite item store if you'd like to support me and the channel at no extra cost whatsoever but do bear in mind that the code does reset every 14 days but with that being said the video comes to an end and i'll see you guys in the next one peace